Now hear me. I have taught you here that all blessings come from God through men to men. All blessings come from God through men to men. All troubles come from Satan through men to men. In any case, men are always the midwives of destiny, whether it is from God or from Satan. Hallelujah. There are many of you, God said yes since January, but the man who will say yes on earth has not been available. And there are forces that have pushed them away. Let me prophesy for your destiny helpers. Because you see, let me tell you, you are as powerful as those who support what you represent. The Bible says in the multitude of men is a king's honor, not in the multitude of your gift. Every man ordained by God to respond to you favorably this year and for whatever reason, maybe by demonic intrusion, their attention has been taken away from you. I speak to the north, the south and the east and the west. I command your helpers to gravitate towards you. I command your helpers to gravitate towards you. Gravitate towards you. Hallelujah. One of the mysterious spiritual currencies that buys a life of dignity and honor, including wealth, is this grace called favor. Favor is a grace. Look up, please. The understanding that favor is unmerited is not accurate. Favor is very merited. Favor is multidimensional. The dimension of favor that is not merited is the grace that administers salvation. But favor is merited. Proverbs 13, 15. It says, good understanding procured favor. Please give it to us. Good understanding giveth favor. But the way of the transgressor, the violator of patterns is hard. How do you know favor is on your life? The real proof of favor is access to the heart of men. You know you are favored to the degree to which there are men to answer and attend to the matters of your life. Favor carries a tripartite expression. Please listen. Favor, genuine Bible favor carries a tripartite expression. Number one, unusual kindness. Number two, unusual acceptance. Number three, unusual access until this tripartite expression is captured in your life it is not favor and i've told you if it happens only once it's not favor it's breakthrough but not favor favor must happen repeatedly regardless of the circumstances exodus 3 21 and i will give these people favor pay attention please in the sight of the Egyptians and it shall come to pass that when ye go, help me please, ye shall not go empty. Psalm 44 and verse 3, for those who have been trusting God for structural establishment, here is the secret. They got not the land in possession by their own sword, neither did their own arm save them. But your right hand and thine arm, it says, and the light of thy countenance because thou hast a favor towards them. Esther 2.15, the B part, the little village girl Hadassah who was brought from Shushan, the Bible says, and Esther obtained favor in the eyes of how many? All. When favor comes on you, the only person who cannot bless you is a blind man, provided they have eyes to see. All them that looked upon her, verse 17, not even the king was spared. And the king loved Esther above all the women and she obtained grace and favor in his sight more than all the virgins I know what favor is believe me with all humility I can tell you I may not know everything about it but there is something I know about the favor of God as we have received by grace in the name of Jesus upon someone 
right now someone who is tired karakos palakatos from the depth of my heart i pray for you as we have received freely may this grace called favor rest upon you now may this grace called favor rest upon you now may this grace called favor rest upon you now i speak to you obtain unusual kindness from men unusual acceptance with men unusual access to the hearts and the resources of men the favor of god is the number one reason people succeed i have taught you again and again that in this kingdom who hates you does not matter but who likes you matters there are people who you cannot cast away the bible says when a man's ways pleases the lord he makes even his enemies there are some enemies you can't cast away you have to pray for a right of passage into their heart otherwise that door will not be open they are called gatekeepers the covenant that binds them is beyond their attitude even in their fallen state the throne of god still acknowledges them you won't pray them away you will pray for favor for instance there was no way to bound to bind and cast pharaoh if david was waiting if if joseph was waiting to bind and cast pharaoh to be prime minister he would have waited forever when god wants to lift joseph he will make pharaoh have a dream that only joseph can interpret and give him access to the palace the wine presser said i remember my wrong this day there was a young man who has been locked up my carelessness has added two years extra to his life and they said go and bring him and the bible says the king sent for joseph and they brought him out of his dungeon not god there are men who can send for you and bring you out of certain realms it was the king that sent for joseph never to return to the prison again whoever needs to send for you in the name of jesus may the voice of favor call them May the voice of favor call them. May the voice of favor call them. Whoever must send for your family in this period, whoever must send for your ministry, whoever must send for your value, may favor compel them to call you. Hallelujah. Let me tell you the truth. This world is a very selfish world. It takes the favor of God for people to turn their hearts and their minds and their eyes away from the nuances and distractions and to focus on your destiny to lift you. This world is not that kind. I can tell you, people are very selfish. They are about and justifiably so. Everybody is focused on building their destiny. Whatever will make someone suspend attention over his destiny and invest his attention, his credibility, his resources on you must not be natural. Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel, and ransom captive Israel. Oh, come, oh, come, Emmanuel, and ransom captive Israel. Rejoice, rejoice, Emmanuel has come to you, his Israel. Rejoice, rejoice. Emmanuel, he has come to you, his Israel. Can I pray for speed? Listen, again I have taught you in this house that the unit of destiny is time. And one of the ways to abort a glorious destiny is to corrupt the potential for achieving much with respect to time your lifetime is a measure of your birth from the day you transit separated from your body and one of the strategies to abort great destinies is that satan creates obstructions and impedances on your way so that you are not able to do much in time 
but there are two systems of advantage that have been deployed by the intelligence of God to remedy that constraint number one is called restoration number two is called speed when these twofold forces work in the life of a man you must gain time restoration brings back time speed accelerates you to do much within a short time this is what I want to declare over your life. Speed is a very powerful system of advantage that much can be done within a short time. In the name of Jesus, I call upon the God who called me, the one by whom we have obtained apostles. In the name of Jesus Christ, by this apostolic and prophetic mantle, I speak to someone. May that grace for speed come upon you now. May that grace for speed come upon you now. Receive that grace right now. Receive that grace right now. Receive that grace right now. Hallelujah. Let me declare over you. If there is anybody here that the spirit of death is already tracking, that 20, help them please, that 2022 will be your last year and then something mysterious will happen in the name of jesus i pray you shall not die i say it to you prophetically you shall not die not by the arrows that fly by day not the noisome pestilences not the destruction that waste in noonday i speak to you that a thousand shall fall by your side and ten thousand by your right side but none shall come nigh you with your eyes will you see and behold even the reward of the wicked in the name of jesus christ job said the lord will deliver you from six things Yes, seven. One of it is the 